morning youtubers or afternoon according to three so I guess it's afternoon so this is something that uh, one of my uh, fellow youtubers had talked about putting on uh, this is basically a uh, it's a um, slip ring for uh, wind turbines when they're on the pole um, so they it provides the ability for it to uh, turn and transfer the electricity um, through the cable so if your turbine spins around a lot like some of them do um, when you get random winds you'll have this thing turning um, so what you would basically do is attach one end to your turbine the other end to your wires going down the pole and it would it spins it's uh, not cooperating at the moment because I don't know but basically it spins now you know what's interesting about this unit is is that you would think that you would just install it this way but in actuality the epoxy den is right there so this goes into the pole this way or it goes into your bracket you'd have to figure out the type of turbine you have on how it would mount we are using the uh, PMAs PMGs uh, that are similar to but not to be confused of the uh, Delco uh, alternators then it would go on top of that bracket that you got from whoever and um, would go like that or you would slide it up into that bracket and mount it somehow now see it has mounting holes so you could drill three holes into the bracket and then mount it with some you know nuts and washers or tapping screws or however you wish to do it uh, but it's 12 gauge wire and uh, so it will be good for uh, you know most of them out there that I know of and uh, the other end of course attaches to your down leads uh, which could be I've been using an outdoor extension cord but you can just buy the cable at the supply house uh, you want to use a multi-strand not a solid wire like this is a multi-strand and uh, for the wild AC that will come out of it and then you'll bring it down to your uh, powerhouse and run it through a rectifier to your uh, voltage for your batteries being 12, 24 or 48 uh, so I actually found this on Amazon uh, for $15 and I've seen it as high as $45 on some sites which is interesting but um, I have Prime membership of course so I get it free shipping so I'm willing to wait um, if you have a really tall tower you probably can get away with not having one of these because you have a lot of time for that cable to twist back and forth but if you're using a short something under 10 feet um, tower that's maybe mounted on a roof or or uh, top of a tree or something <laughs> whatever you fancy um, these would be handy um, says that it has a pretty good 600 volts 30 amps um, so that's pretty good so that'll definitely handle you know what we put through it on a PMA uh, there's probably other uses too you could probably use it for you know race car maybe I don't know maybe you can I don't know, use it at a parade there you go see see you could use it at a parade you know there's a lot of uses for it cheap but for now 